you walk around feeling that you know what your goals are and that you can choose the best action to achieve them. But the truth is that even before you realize what your goals are, a bunch of neurons inside your head already knows what's going to happen to your body and has already taken a decision for you. My name is Giuliano Urigli and I run the Armenese Harvard Laboratory of Systems Neurobiology at Italian Institute of Technology here in Trento. Like many neuroscientists, we are interested uh, in the human brain. And so, you know, we would like to know why do we do what we do? However, for one, we think that this question is too vague, and so we like to rephrase it in a more actionable fashion. And so the question becomes how neural circuits inside our heads extract information from the environment and then use this information to drive our decisions. Of course, you can't take a person and crack open his skull and look inside his head for neural circuits. And so we use uh, animal models. And these animal models are remarkably uh, accessible to the kind of measurements that we like to do. And with this kind of measurements, we try and discover those uh, neural principles that constrain and govern the behavior of an animal. So we look for behavioral patterns, uh, then we look for the uh, neural laws, and then uh, we use uh, mathematical computational models that help us to understand how these neural laws rule the behavioral patterns. We do basic uh, science. And so our work is hard to understand, even for uh, clinicians and uh, engineers. But uh, look, therapists don't magically grow in hospitals. Therapies come from new discoveries, and new discoveries come from new ideas. I like to think of people who develop uh, tech and uh, drugs, like these brilliant chefs who like to cook delicious food to make people happy. However, any successful chef needs an actor who look for new ingredients for his kitchen. And so we basic researchers are like these hunters. It's, it all starts in labs like ours, uh, with people like us who uh, sometimes don't even know uh, what is unknown, and so we make guesses. Uh, they are educated guesses, uh, but still guesses. And it's like running a marathon, where you basically don't know where the finish line is, and so there are these moments of pain and moments uh, where actually you play, but uh, it's always exciting to know that at the end of this race you're going to make a change in the world. And so it's for this reason that I'm so grateful to the Harmonies and Harvard Foundation for supporting uh, scientists like us. Mm -hmm.